When making videos either on YouTube or any other type of platform, having clean and crisp audio is one of the most important things to do. So today we're going to be unboxing the Rode VideoMic Pro Plus. Welcome to yet another tech unbox video. Today we're going to be unboxing the Rode VideoMic Pro Plus, which is a shotgun or boom style microphone. Currently we use a lav style microphone to capture the audio that you hear in these videos. And that certainly does be either not having a microphone at all or taking two different files and then syncing them in post-production. I've not really been a fan of the way that they look on camera. So having that Rode shotgun mic is still going to allow me to get that crisp, clean audio, but still minimize and simplify my setup process when it comes to recording videos. We're just going to jump right in. We've got the box. You've got a nice little window so you can see the Rode mic right there inside and of course the rechargeable battery. And if you know anything about this microphone, you'll know that the Pro Plus has a rechargeable battery. There's a few other features that we will go into later on in this video, but that's one of the big pluses right there is it does have a rechargeable battery. So flip it on over. We've got a little bit of information on the side. If you register the device, you've got an actual 11 year warranty. So I would highly recommend doing that. You've got the shock mount, the included battery optimized for the windshield shape. Flip it on over, you've got your box contents in various different languages. We're not gonna waste time going through that. We'll cover some of this in the video. And because I don't actually have a knife, I'm just going to see if the propellers from my DJI Spark are gonna work. Everything's pretty straightforward in here. We can see already the contents of the actual box. The Rode mic, which is, if you look up the dimensions of the old Rode mic Pro, it is a little bit like uh, taller if I remember correctly, but it's less wide. So you're kind of trading it off, but as you can see, it is a nice, it's got a nice windscreen on there. It's got a hot shoe mount, the anti-shock mount as well. So that's super nice. But the biggest, one of the biggest features of this is the cord is now removable. You've got your microphone, you've got your three and a half to three and a half millimeter audio jack, and then you've got a micro USB cable to charge the battery while it's inside the microphone. So let's go ahead and take a look at the features that this thing has versus the Rode Mic Pro. First and foremost, the Pro Plus now has advanced audio options, including a high pass filter switch, which allows you to reduce any type of low frequency audio, such as like a distant lawnmower or a car passing by. And it also has a safety channel built in, which prevents any type of unexpected loud noises or clippings. The audio cable on the Pro Plus is now a removable cable, which is a huge upgrade from the regular Pro. In the event that the cord gets damaged, you can replace it with just another cord without having to need to send it into Rode to replace. Another major upgrade over the Pro is the amount of power options we have. Included is a lithium ion rechargeable battery boasting over 100 hours of power, as well as a micro USB cable that you can plug in the back to give it a constant power source. If neither one of these options work for you, you do have the ability to put in two AA batteries batteries to continue powering it. The Pro Plus does now have an automatic on and off feature, which is definitely my most favorite feature about this particular microphone. I can't tell you how many times I've gone and either recorded a video just to realize I had forgotten to turn on the microphone, or I have turned off the camera and then forgot to turn off the microphone only to come back to a dead battery. So the ability to go in, plug the microphone in, turn the camera on and it automatically fires on the microphone. And then of course, if you turn off the camera as well, it'll take just a moment, but it will also turn the microphone off, allowing you to save and maximize your battery. Here we have an example of what the two audio sounds like between the two different microphones. So this particular clip, the audio is coming through the lav mic that I have currently clipped on my shirt. This is an example of the audio coming through the Rode mic. I don't have any of the advanced settings actually on. Everything is turned off and the settings are exactly how they are coming straight from the box. Now, before we end today's video, there's a few more features on this thing that I wanted to show you guys that I actually just noticed is first off, if you look at the audio cable, it might be a little hard to see, but it actually does have thread. So if you end up getting an audio cable and you don't have to you don't want to worry it pulling it out it does have the ability to thread the cable on there that way you don't have to worry about that and not to mention just simple things like this on the bottom where you have your audio cable and then you can plug it in and then it does have like a little clip just so you can organize that audio cable and get it out of the way it's small things like that that make a product that much better so the first impressions that I have so far on this thing are absolutely phenomenal. The build quality is really good. The audio quality is really good. It's got some awesome features. It is a little bit more expensive of a price, but you're getting the Rode quality of a shotgun microphone. And for that, you just can't beat it. And for my particular case, it does allow me to spend more time actually filming and less time setting up just because it's so simple. It allows my setup to be a little bit more of a frictionless setup. And that wraps up today's tech unbox, bringing us into our question of the day. What other shotgun mics would you recommend? 
and connect with me in the comments below. If you enjoyed this type of content, be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it on all of the different types of social platforms. Check out some of the other videos that we have on this channel. We do a ton of stuff tech related. Here are a couple examples for you. Subscribe, of course, if you're not already and enable the bell notification so you guys don't miss out on any type of future content. And we will see you on the next one.